At Healthcare Partners Medical Group, our mission is to provide the highest quality of healthcare to each and every patient. With five locations in Pahrump, we are local doctors you know and trust. We want to thank you for choosing us. Quality care starts here. We actually had the opportunity at the hospital here today to participate in this every 15 minute program. We had a patient that was actually brought in by helicopter and by the ambulance uh, to be treated for uh, injuries sustained in a drunk driving incident. One of the patients, I believe his name is Ty, is suffering, he's in a coma, right? He's going to be in a coma for a while. We're afraid that um, uh, the prognosis is not real good for him. And unfortunately, the other patient that they brought in uh, did, not, uh, did not survive. She seemed okay at first, and then she coded. And the doctors actually um, performed CPR on her for quite a while. The doctors did uh, do the drugs and all the, all the measures that you would take to sustain life, and it was... Uh, it just didn't work at this point in time, and uh, we unfortunately had to pronounce her. This is an everyday occurrence at the hospital for various different reasons. It was kind of uh, dramatic to see what the doctors and uh, you were calling times of uh, different times that they were putting in administering dis different drugs. Keep the times uh, in order to keep a record of what happened, the medications that go in. The doctor wants to know when the code first started, what happened. So that gives us a very accurate record and detailed record of what goes on during, the, during that process, during that code process. The female flatlined here, and uh, then her parent was in a room waiting, and you had to go uh, talk to the parent. Uh, Dr. Weissman did indeed go in and visit with the parent, explain the extent of the injuries, and explain that uh, that there was uh, there was nothing we could do, and uh, she had passed away. So she, uh, the mom came in to see her daughter here. Yes, the mother came in to see the daughter. Dr. Weissman was with her, and she was. Uh, it was explained a little bit more what had happened. And it's a very emotional scene for uh, people. Even when you're prepared for that, Deanna, it, it's a very emotional scene, and uh, elicited a, a great deal of emotional response, not only from the, from the mom of the intended victim, but from the people around here. You notice a lot of the a lot of the students here had tears in their eyes when they were, when that information came through. Well, I thought it was sad and. Uh it made me think a little bit not to drink, you know, while driving. You know, I don't do anything because I'm an athlete. But yeah, and then her, I don't know. It was very emotional, especially because my mom was involved in everything. And it's just crazy to show that this stuff really does happen and could happen to anyone. It happens all the time, unfortunately. You passed away? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I got transported to the hospital and I died. And they told my mom the bad news. And it's sad. It's very heartbreaking. <laughs> Did this bring some reality to uh, you guys life because uh, you know a lot of times people don't think that this uh, happens to them. Uh, It'll definitely make us think twice. <laughs> yeah I'll never do it ever. You were in a coma? Yeah yeah you know I was in a coma and no one came to me. <laughs> Just kidding. So what vehicle were you guys in? The car that was um, the victims of the actual drunk driver, right, in a, he was an opposing. He was with the victim. I was with the drunk driver. My date was the drunk driver, unfortunately.